We have with us today in our chair uh, Ms. Mara Hitner with Matter Hackers and uh, Mr. Gabriel Ortiz uh, from Meltio. So I'm so glad you guys have a, a, a wonderful announcement to share with the Milliam community. So Mara, I'm going to start off with you. Yeah, just uh, thank, thanks for having me back. Yes. Um, love being at, uh, at Mill AM. And uh, yeah, I mean, Matter Hackers, um, we're doing great. We had a really good year. Um, we brought on a couple of new partners, um, and one of them is Meltio. Yay. And super excited because I've been hearing the Meltio name here at Mill AM for quite some time. And so when my friend Gabriel uh, started working there, I was like, hey, you guys should maybe look at Mill I'm like, yes, <laughs> absolutely. Awesome. Because the desktop customers that we've always had at Matter Hackers um, are now looking at metal and really seriously and so it just makes sense for matter hackers to offer more solutions and uh, we're super excited to uh, have a booth here with Meltio. Well you continue to ramp up your offering so I'm excited to hear about what you have to say about this uh, Gabriel. Well like Mara said we've been working together for a number of years I've been coming to Milan for a number of years yeah. and this event continues to grow mm -hmm. is becoming the premier event for the Department of Defense so we're excited to be here and I'm Specifically excited to be here with Mara and Mara Hackers. They, and an a excellent entity to work for mm -hmm. or work with, and uh, they have very similar values on how to take care of end customers. And yes. we always look for that type of alignment. Yeah, I I know from working with with Matter Hackers for a number of years, they definitely put their values out front, and uh, when they take you on as a a product, they will promote you and make sure that the right customers plug in. I've seen that. And with respect to the Meltio brand, I also have become aware of the brand uh, over a few years and uh, seen the, the various companies that are integrating your uh, technology with their systems and their platforms. And so I'm wondering if you guys could talk about how you see this happening on it from a training perspective as well as just in general, what are your hopes for um, integrating this product? So I think that uh, metal printing is not by any means a new proposition to the industry, right? So it's a normal tendency for a lot of companies that find themselves with obsolete components, obsolete parts, or environments that are not the preferred environment for equipment to be placed there on its own. So yeah. the metal yeah. approach is definitely one that makes it much more easier to perform in areas that are not the ideal scenarios for technology. So yes. our offering to the market has everything to do with making things easy and accessible. Well, how is it going to be more accessible, Mara, because of this partnership? Yeah, well, I mean, the nice thing for those of you who don't know Meltio, um, it's a DED wire technology. Yes. yes. <clears throat> so you're literally like, yeah, so here's a beautiful Great full metal part. But it's so cool because like coming from filament for me, um, it's literally just using welding wire instead of filament. Yes. Um, and then they've got a, a blue laser. It's mm -hmm. fast. Um, the So where uh, Matter Hackers is selling the standalone um, Meltio. Mm. So, I mean, it's just a big old big old printer yeah. that's just printing uh, straight metal and any metal that can be any metal that's been made into welding wire can be used on this machine um, so, so it's for for um, uh, logistics um, for getting uh, as close to the point of need um, as possible um, to go. be uh, safe for using on ships um, it's a different type of technology than like you know powder for example which um, has a lot more complexities so we're making it easy by offering a very easy technology that is accessible for people that need it to get close to point of need we're also providing all of the um, install training um, and any um, uh, training that you need moving forward as well to make sure that the machines are being used um, and are being used properly to solve problems I think this is exciting because I, over the last few years, when I did an industrial survey with our partner from uh, the Association for Manufacturing Technology, AMT, the number one technology that folks wanted access to for additive was DED. And so uh, I believe this partnership makes it more accessible 
um, and the combined training and all of the things that Matter Hackers provides to have things on the GSA schedule and all of the government check boxes that are needed is, is important so our servicemen and women can actually use it when they need it as well. So I am personally very excited to see this and um, getting your technology out to more people. Um, I think calling it additive makes welding much sexier uh, than maybe it was before. But look Welding's how beautiful always that been is. pretty it's, sexy. Well, I, I agree. Mean, let's be Did you ever see Flash Dance? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. come on. She's yeah, a maniac, right? <laughs> so I want to thank you all for being here, for continuing to do what you do, and push the, push the line to get this technology out to more people. So thank you, and um, who knows what we're going to see next year. Thank you, America Much Makes. Much more of the same. Making it easy. Yes, make Thank it easy. Thank you so much. Love it. <laughs> See you.